Hey yo, this is Dash, and this is your opportunity to ask me anything you want to. Well, almost anything. If you guys don't know, if you weren't around for last year, during the month of December, when barbecue views are down, we got to do something to help get those views back up. That being said, what I'm going to do for the month of December is you guys get to ask me almost anything. So all you have to do is leave a comment down below, ask me a question, and I hopefully will get to respond to it in the form of a video. So don't be bashful. It really won't take more than about half the month to hopefully get enough questions for me to answer and do a video every single day. I really would like for you to ask me a question down in the comments below. Thanks as always for watching, and I hope to answer your question soon. All right, so we are back at it, and let's find another another question. I'm, I'm going through my comments in that very first video. And again, don't forget, if you have a question, please don't forget to leave it down below. All right, <clears throat> so next question is gonna be from Mark. Mark N asks, what was the most important lesson you learned this year? With the fact that I have not been cooking as much as I would have liked to, I didn't let that deter me from trying to get things done. I just had to do things a little bit differently. Obviously, you guys know I run a YouTube channel. With the fact that I run a YouTube channel, the, a lot of the content from my YouTube channel comes from the cooks that I do for other people. Well, when I'm not cooking for other people, what do I have to do? I have to stretch out the content. Some of you guys were okay with that. Some of you guys were like, why can't you just make this one episode? Well, apparently I talk too much and I can't <laughs> cut down videos and do them rather quickly. So what I ended up having to do was I ended up having to space out videos. And because I was spacing out the videos, I could film a video. So let's say I filmed two videos on a Saturday. And the way my my video schedule is, I put up a video every Tuesday and every Thursday morning, and I'll do a live stream on Wednesday evening, okay? With that being said, if I take one video and I break it into two, then as opposed to me having to film two videos, I film one video and I space it out. So now the two videos that I filmed, let's say on a Saturday or a Tuesday, okay, I can now have two weeks of content and that gives me 14 days basically to film another maybe one or two videos so that was one of the things that I, I had to to learn I had to to stretch my content if you will I, I mean almost like a time management type thing but as opposed to being a time management it's more of a content management hopefully that makes sense mark thank you so very much for your question and uh, don't forget ask me your question hopefully I get to answer it